Hello and welcome. I'm UK Gamer 808 and today we are looking at some new Farming Simulator 19 mods just been released in the Mod Hub update and there's quite a few bits and bobs going on today. New maps and all sorts. Can't be bad for a Friday. So the first mods we're looking at and we're going to do a first look mod review on the Class Axiom 960-930. We finally got it out for console and here it is nice bit of kit and then the other one we're looking at is the John Deere 9000 series forage harvester with the John Deere 390 plus header so let's get cracked on looking at the case the case the class is a class it's not a case right so we, this one has got the tracks on the back obviously and it looks pretty pretty cool fair play the detailing on it, this one well it is giant so you expect it to have no issues whatsoever and yeah fantastic looks bloody bloody nice really does nice bit of kit now three hundred and fifty five thousand pounds to buy it and initial leasing costs are eighteen thousand one hundred and five pounds so what about slots well it's class and it's going to be high isn't it and it is it's minus 39 on the slots comes with two different engine options let's fire it up so we've got the 930 which is the 355 horsepower which is the standard one and it, it's got a 24 well it says in the shop see again it says 24 mile an hour top speed and there it's showing 26 and yeah it does 26 sounds pretty cool now turning on this really good it is really good look how tight the st steering is on it we go along and then we just hard lock round and look at that that's pretty good quite impressed with that so if you want the a larger setup for the on the engine the 960 option which will give you the 445 horsepower so well you're not gonna be struggling with 445 horsepower and for the extra upgrade on initial leasing it was only about extra grand so you might as well have it because the cost of extra horsepower is an extra £35,000 so it's going to come in at oh, just over four hundred grand. but it's a large tractor large tractors are large money simple as that really isn't it so jump inside and we did have quite a few stages of lighting where you had that, that one there was doing the, those front four then it also does the back the top ones and the bottom ones on the back now and then we got main beam on the front as well which is all of those lights and there's loads of lights on there there really is and then off again and then beacons no doors opening or any of that but fantastic new fs19 mod can't beat them i know pc have had this for a while and i've never been a fan with the tracks and the wheels at the front but the way this is all moving it, uh, it looks pretty cool and it does the job so we got a Cargos trailer and we can get the John Deere into action which we got a field of corn ready to go and we test out this tractor but nice bit of kit really is fantastic bit of kit waiting for big tractors and we get one yesterday and one today can't be bad right so let's have a look at the 9000 series and i've got the big boy there are quite a few engine options on this one so let's get it off the trailer right so there it is now I expected this to be extortionate amounts of money compared to the rest but it's not it's pretty well priced it's £361,500 to buy and your initial leasing costs are £18,487 minus 39 on the slot count so 39 and 39 
for both of these today you're starting on main setup slots pretty quick which is always pretty pants for console but what can you do nothing get on with it right so this one is engine wise you start off with a 770 horsepower which is the 9700 and that's the standard one and then it goes up to the 9800 which is 870 horsepower it's got actually a decent trailer hitch on the back of it as well so that's 870 horsepower and if you want this one which is the 9900 and that will cut is the 970 horsepower and it's an extra 50 grand so 400 grand is going to cost you just over 400,000 for the larger upgrade one but that's still cheap now the detailing on this is well it's spectacular it really is oh yeah you can't fault it you really can't even down to the fire extinguishers placed in there it is pretty cool so let's jump inside and um, we didn't jump inside the class actually do we right we'll do that in a minute and good visibility obviously all the way around pipe and fold and there are a couple of different pipe options on it where this one is the long pipe you can see it folds away like that and this one will cost you eight grand there is a middle pipe and the standard pipe this, the middle pipe is about half as long as this again it's probably about that that length like that bit on the top there that's four grand and the, the only other options are tires where you can have mitus which i've got out at the moment these are quite big chunky ones you've got mitus and michelins and that's a lot so we got a buddy seat in here i didn't notice that earlier and we've got the action on the stick there i do like the indicators there on the little console over on that side and then the lights do light up on the giant fm but yeah nice bit of kit it's nice to see a john deere harvester well forage harvester a good steering on this one we never have any issues with rear wheel steering really don't but cracking bit of kit plenty of lighting going on the first one brings on your lighting on the back there and then I, I just noticed that light on the boom there so we've got that one that light there and then that one and then on the front so we'll have a look on the front as well so yeah masses of lights cracking bit of kit So there is our header. So let's have a quick look at the John Deere header because I didn't understand. It says in the mod hub it's the Kemper pack, and it said that these can be crone and different makes. There was a few other makes as well, and it's not. So I don't know what that's all about. I just don't know. So here we have the John Deere 390 Plus, which is a harvester attachment for the forage harvester now this one will only do corn and it's nine meters wide now this alone is 18 slots so that and the john deere you're talking a lot of slots for just these two combined now this same again i thought it'd be expensive but it's not it's the same cost as the other ones we've got so it's 120,000 and then 6,120 pounds for your initial leasing now when i seen these bits on the side i thought well what are they where are they going to go? What are they going to do with them? But I'll show you that in a, in a moment. So that is the header. Let's get it attached and get cutting some corn. Right, so let's get that unfolded. And you watch what happens to those bits I just said to you about. Because when they folded out there, I thought, hey, where are they going to go then? And then it all unfolds out and they just disappear like that. Fire it up. Let's get in position first, shall we? Let's turn it around this way. He's already on the case with that trailer. So we see how far it fires fires out. 
and we can put the worker on there so going inside here and it is the same as the other cases I think isn't it it all lights up it seems to be so And no issues there, all seems to be working fine. Right, let's get that back out, because I wanted to see what the animation was like on this head. If we can zoom in enough, we probably can't. Ah, oh, there we go. Pretty cool. Now, will it let you unload? I doubt it will, will it? No. All working, no issues. Nice bit of kit. At least we got the right headers for the right harvesters because some of these do have issues fitting where sometimes they lift the wheels off the ground and that sort of stuff so that did save a little bit in there but not a lot right there were there we go that is the john deere 9000 series and the axion 960 930 class terror track awesome bits of kit right oh well that's it for today we're gonna get on with this field and then i've got to get cracked on with i'm just starting a, a let's play on seasons so if you're into that go and have a look at that later on now if you've enjoyed this video make sure you smash that like button for me and if you are new to the channel then make sure you go and check one of my hundreds of other farming simulator videos i think by the end of the weekend we're going to be on 600 so there we are getting there right out thanks for watching till the next time goodbye